I'm going to start with Mr. Enriquez, if that's okay with you, Ms. Session. Mr. Enriquez, what is your business? Uh, we're an event production and management company. Are you the owner? Yes, I am. How long have you had it? Since uh, 2004, that's when I started my business. And who do you work with? I work with several different uh, uh, vendors. So. Okay, so what you do is people are really booking you for whatever talent you have. Correct. And depending upon what they need, you reach out to your vendors, get stuff for they need, and you coordinate putting the stuff together. So Correct. people are really paying you for your talent. Correct. And you would agree with me that that's a unique thing. Yes. Because other than that, someone could go to the vendors themselves and say, listen, I need tables and chairs and tents and things, you know, and just deliver them and I'll put them together. But hiring you gives one a sense of things will get done Correct. because Mr. Rodriguez is going to take care of it. Correct. Yeah. Didn't we do that well? You did. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happened. Miss Session authored a book. And she wanted to do a book party. Not necessarily a really expensive book party, but she was bringing together a whole host of people to sort of get the talk going about this book. I'll let you show me the book. Okay. So she hired you to plan an event. And your planning of an event, nice. Get your career life in order. I should read it myself. <laughs> Part of what she was supposed to do is you were supposed to coordinate bringing the tents and things so that she could display the books inside. And she was planning on having how many people? Uh, close to about 100 people or so. And you were supposed to provide tents? We were providing actually a sponsorship. Uh, a sponsorship, so, what does that mean? A uh, sponsorship meaning we were actually gonna be providing a lot of stuff for free. What were you supposed to provide not for free because she paid you money? There was a couple of things that uh, she had asked for in the beginning that what did she pay you for? Uh, what she did pay for was the actual, give me one quick second. Smart TV, basically, where she uh, Just needed. Just a second. Smart TV. Correct. Uh, the stand for the actual uh, TV as well. And what else were you supposed to provide? Well, what I was supposed to provide was actually the, the full uh, that we were providing and sponsoring was an event tent, 20 by 40. Sure, that's where we're starting, an event tent. Okay. Uh, event seat for 100 people, event tables. And uh, what time was the event supposed to start? It was supposed to start at 11 o'clock. 11 a.m. on what date? On the January 22nd. And in order to set up the tent, tables, chairs, or whatever, give me a figure, a time frame. Should you have been there at 8 o'clock or 8.30 to set up this tent? Uh, we should... You're the event planner. Right, and she paid you four hundred dollars. Uh, the total was the total amount was three eighty-seven twenty-nine. Okay, January twenty-second, two thousand seventeen. Yes, it is pouring. What time should you have been there? Around nine thirty latest. Nine thirty latest. Correct. So let's say nine o'clock. What time did you get there? Um, I wasn't able to actually make it. Right, because due to an incident that we had got into in the freeway. And you moved the event someplace else. Yes. Is that correct? It is. Indoors. Indoors. And you did that very quickly. Yes. On January 22nd. Yes. And she wants her money back. So? I did credit her account back for what she had paid for. Okay, so we do have a store credit, which basically. No, 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 no store credit. <laughs> she didn't give you wampum. She gave you cash money. She don't want a credit. She wants her money back. Got it? Correct. Great. You also want the amount that you had to pay for the second venue. Yes, Your Honor. Well, that's sort of ridiculous because you would have had to pay one venue, if not the other, and it was probably better indoors anyway. Well, However, actually, Your Honor, I'm sorry. The venue, the original venue, was donating the space for us. The guarantee was that the individuals that attended the event, since we had over 100 people RSVP, would cover the cost. But when we moved it, we actually had to pay for catering for the attendees that showed up. That's okay. Three eighty-seven twenty-nine is what you paid him? I paid him, yes. Yeah, that's what you get back. Thank okay. you. Is this for me? Yes. This book? Yes. Thank you.